Hi guys, welcome to the vlog. So I'm about to go wake up the little man so we can start our day. I think we're gonna go get some lunch, but I'm not really sure because Matt's tummy hurts, so I'm not really sure what we're gonna do about food. But then I think we're gonna go over to the Magic Kingdom for some magic. Hopefully the weather will stay good and it won't rain. So let's go wake up little man first. But something I don't know if I told you guys or not. Um, I finally put him in his crib at night. Um, it took me, it took me a hard, a little, a little bit longer. I think it was on me more than him. Like he's fine with it. He's fine with sleeping in his crib. I'm not quite fine with it. <laughs> like we would, I would put him to bed, and then when I was ready to go to bed, I would take him out of his crib and put him in his pack and play next to me. So yeah, I know, I know, I know. But now I finally have him in his crib at night, and he's sleeping perfectly, no problems. Um, it's been probably about a week now. And it's been good. God, look at her room. She's like a real teenager. Look at this room. It's a mess in here. Hi, buddy. Hello. <gasps> Hi. Uh oh. Hi. What are you doing? You want to leave your passy? Can you leave your passy? Oh, look at your toys. Look at. Look at all your toys on the floor. Oi. Hey, you want to go bye bye and go see Mickey Mouse? Oh! You okay? Want to see Mickey Mouse? Come on, leave your passy. Put your passy down. Yay! Good job! No passy! Put passy inside. Drop it. Leave your passy in there. Good. Drop it. Drop it. Drop it. Me. Put your passy inside. Put your passy in. Drop it. Oop. Good job. Mm. Oh. Oh. Uh oh. We are at McDonald's. And hey. I just wanted to show you guys this awesome table. to help it like see that's changing how nope. Nope. <laughs> and wait wait until it turns dark ah. is it? show us the toy hold on show us the toy hold on show it to us <laughs> working out Kevin is that Kevin? Mary, Mary just did a, a good deed. Oh, you don't have to tell her. Why? Good. I gotta put on my seatbelt. Hold on. Oh my God! What happened to me? <laughs> just stopped at Mickey D's for our illustrious lunch. Hmm. So unhealthy. It really got to change it. We're gonna change. There was a huge piece of wood, probably about two feet long by about six inches wide, with three huge nails that were like that sticking out of it in the parking lot. Mary drove by and goes, oh my god, what if somebody ran over that? And you know what she did? Instead of just going on her merry way. Mary, <laughs> Mary. Mary went on her merry way. She got out of her car and picked it up. Isn't that so nice? at first we didn't miss the monorail but there's a five minute delay on the monorail <laughs> so what a surprise we're never lucky with the monorail here oh, oh wait it's here oh it's po wow look at this Cinderella's castle, the best view on Main Street. Except for the balloons, the balloon block it. Monorail suitcase. That's interesting. Pretty cool. I mean, it's kind of small. I'd never use it, but it's pretty cool nonetheless. Pirates of the Caribbean, Dooney and Burke person. That's cool. 
That's new. They're always coming out with new stuff. That's awesome. The Haunted Mansion, Jack, right? Jack Skeleton? I forget his name. They got that one and this one. We're gonna go on Stitch's Great Escape because it's probably gonna get closed soon. It's definitely gonna close when busy season ends. And then they might take it out, so we're gonna go ahead and ride it while it's still open. We just missed it. Ridiculous. It's what time is it? We missed it by an hour, actually. Really? Yeah. Oh. So 10 to 6 every day? Yep. Well, until busy season's over, then they close it. So we gotta make sure we come back between 10 and 6 one day. Why are you sure. crying? Oh, she wanted to ride Stitch. She's never got, she was excited. It's okay, we'll come back, I promise. We're gonna go check the wait time for Space Mountain. Bella wants to ride that, which I'm surprised. But, we gotta see how much time there is, because, I don't know, really don't wanna sit in line that long. What does it say? 85 minutes, ugh. I don't know. This is where they're putting the Tron coaster, back that way through the smoking section. Really excited to see that. They didn't even start yet. He's... Oh, he's so cute. Oh. He just ran from Tomorrowland into Fantasyland in a matter of seconds. The fastest squirrel known to man. Meeting Ariel to Noko. We're striking out on all accounts here today. The, the wait time says 25 minutes. We stood in line for about 15 minutes and didn't move once. So I don't think that wait time is very accurate. One of Ariel's seashells instead and watch her that way. I think it will be a little quicker. There's actually, on this ride, there's a game that you can play. A certain part of the ride, there's Sebastian pops up out of Ariel's treasure. I'll point it out. I'll put that section in the video. I'll point it out. And he pops up three times, and you gotta try and find them all three times. Well, I guess what we learned there is never cross a crane. Okay. No way! Right here, coming up, is the game I was talking about. So, let's see if we can find Sebastian three times before our turn's over. What's this? You've come to a stop? Hmm. Maybe it's that siege. It is just so humid out, like, it's 8.30. It's not really that hot out, but like, I'm sweating. It's just humid, humid, humid. You can smell it in the air, the amount of humidity that's out here. It's a little crazy. It's almost fireworks time, like I said, it's 8.30, so we're gonna go find a good spot for the fireworks, and then pirates to cap off the day. Yo ho, yo ho, fireworks like for me. Dun, dun, dun.
in control of the carpet. This is gonna be fun. Final flight of the night. Here we go. Oh, yeah. Bing, <laughs> bing. Now the fun part, fighting the crowds to get out of here. <laughs> it's always the worst part, at least this particular part, because you're just stuck here and you have to take a monorail or a ferry or a bus and you're just stuck. You can't just walk to your car, which I would love to do so much. That's cool. Radical, bro. It's, let me check the time, it's officially, hold on, hold on, 11.40, it's 11.40, and the park closed at 10, and we're still walking to our car, still trying to get back to our car, almost two hours to get out of the park, ridiculous, and all the buses are packed still, the ferries are packed still. They just closed down the monorail and kicked out like a thousand people out of line. So a little tip, if you, if you are coming to Magic Kingdom, either leave before the fireworks, which stinks, or just expect to spend at least two hours in line waiting to get out on busy nights. I mean, we've gone quicker, but tonight's been busy. And with that, that's it. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Make sure it's always made with love. Peace.